वेलकम टू ज्ञान ज्योति ऑनलाइन क्लासेस क्लास सेवेन इंग्लिश ग्रामर चैप्टर एटीन टॉपिक इज प्रीपोजिशन सो स्टूडेंट लेट स्टार्ट प्रीपोजिशन एंड इफ नो द डेफिनेशन यू वो ऑल इन ग्रुप ऑफ वर्ड्स दैट शोज प्लेस पोजिशन टाइम और मूवमेंट इन प्लेस टू नाउ सब्जेक्ट एंड इज द सब ऑर्डिनेट क्लॉज मीच मेन क्लॉज का एक छोटा सा टुकड़ा है जैसे कि पेड़ का एक ब्रांच है ऐसा ही गिव द बुक टू हु जो कोई चाहते हैं लेकिन यहाँ पर जो कोई चाहते हैं सेंटेंस इन कम्प्लीट विदाउट इज मैन सेंटेंस यहाँ पर टू यूज हो गए ऑब्जेक्ट पार्ट में क्लॉज यूज हुआ या टू डिस्पीपुलेशन यूज After that, the object part which we even want that the clause. Yeah, that is now clear. Okay. So all these things we discuss that are where we can use this prepositions. It is given in this diagram. That you understand. And let's see object part. The cranes do over oceans. Over means prepositions. The ocean is the object part. Cranes chilly do. Ocean do super man do. Okay. That must be. After the preposition of object part is here, we will actually discuss you. So we will understand this chart and write the writing on this point. I will give you what I have, whatever I have discussed, that you would have understood. Prepositions you have known indicate relationships with regard to place, position, time, direction, or movement. According to the place. Position, time, direction, or movement. How the preposition is used. We shall discuss here. I will show you the blackboard. 
for your we are waiting him. We are waiting in the good place of to hold the hijar kanane. So this shows the place. Okay? This people just want to use in to show the place. It's okay? Next number example. Few among the children were excited about the field. Few among. How many few among position? Bahut kumasi kam. Pura is field variable. Site and the like this. Film and not all the maximum general like this type of film, okay? So film is no more. That's the position is showing, okay? But this big position is showing the position, okay? Next one, right, we can say, as soon as we heard the door bell, we ran towards the door, the door. As soon as we heard the door bell, they say, I'm going to the house bell. We ran towards the door, door to the house, door bell. Means motion, towards the door means a movement, motion, man. Door to him, man. At the door, so the door, okay. The people just have movement, okay. Yes, just like uh, I ran into the classroom. Madam, my classroom, and then my door to me, I am. Yes, motion into and uh, towards, etc. is used, okay. We did down the way we did. Down, down means direction. When the yeni matlab us se pahari na ke yeni usko dalan hai, uske niche taraf hum gaye. We tip down, down. So the so the direction. So this preposition of can be used in regard to with regard to place, position, time, direction, and movement. So it is all about this point we can discuss. And now let's see some relation how this position is used just like relation of place and position. Just like position in, at, above, behind, between, in front of, next to, over, under, above, opposite, below, beside, near, near to, close to, etc. These are the preposition are used in the place of position. For example, when we jump to say, the dictionary is on the table. The dictionary is on the table. Place position. We can say, Manisha is standing beside her father. Beside her father. Manisha is standing beside her father. Yes, beside her father. Can I bring brother? I am closer to the stage than last one. Yes, position. Closer to the stage. Uh, stage than Lakshman. Closer to the closer to closer to. Yes, next example. Place the base between two cells. Place the base. Yes. Position I discuss next point I am going to discuss and I think whatever I discuss you have understood. So students now let's discuss about next point. This preposition is used in the relation to the time. Yes, for time. Let's see here. Preposition which are used in this time group. Let's discuss during, for, from, to, in, on, till, from. Until, within, since, after, before. These are the preconditions which are used in relation to time. 
let's discuss about one of the examples. See, I write at 4 o'clock. The time is 4 o'clock. At this point, I use to show time. Is clear to understand? Time. Samay ko dinata. I have been studying since morning. Yes. Or I have been uh, online recording since fast number period. I can see. Since fast number period. So the since is used for the fixed period of the time. And this preposition is used to show time. It's okay. The letters at dinner together on Monday. Yes, Sambar Hul, Sammil Ke Hum Raat Ka Bhojan Karenge. Yes, that means the on is the preposition used for time. On Monday, on Sunday, etc. On Sunday, Monday, you have to know on, in, off, different preposition used for time and you have to practice it, read it and thoroughly go and you can understand these type of different types of use of preposition. Is it clear to understand? Now let's come to the next point. Direction of movement. Direction of movement to Chalna, Fina, either east, west, north, south. These are the directions. Okay? In these type of sentences, uh, what type of preposition you just like through, across, around, up, to, towards, after, before, to, to the left, to the right. Yes? Go to the right where you can find a person of okay, say against, from, of, for. Or into, you know, given by into, onto, etc. These are the words used for showing direction of movement for the this for this sentence. People just okay. The children threw stone into the room. But the talab me patthar feke. Patthar feke means that is the motion. पत्थर जा के गिरा वो जो कुछ इस मौसम को दिखाया मूवमेंट को दिखाया यस और आई कैन से स्टूडेंट वर सिटिंग द टीचर कैम इनटू द क्लास इनटू द क्लास मींस चलते हुए अंदर आए दैट इज आल्सो मौसम द मॉन्की जंप ऑन टू द ब्रांच डालियों के ऊपर जो जो बंदर लोग कूदे दैट इज आल्सो मौसम ऑन टू दैट इज मौसम ओके he saw across the river. Nadi ke us paar ko tera. That is motion. Tera ko ek work ho raha hai, working. That is the continuous process, continuous tense. Okay. He saw across the river. So we have discussed the place and time and direction of movement. What are the preposition used? And we have to more go through and we have to practice again and again. So now students, uh, some more prepositions. According to the way it is used, would have its place under several categories. Some preposition indicates, you can see first of all, some more prepositions, agent or instrument. Yes, agent or instrument may use your type preposition. Just like, please send this parcel by courier. Who agent is courier? This parcel to courier is in here. So courier एक एजेंट है जिससे कि बाय प्रीपोजिशन यूज टू दिस एजेंट ओपन द डोर विथ दिस की विथ इस की के सहायता से दरवाजा खोलो विथ मींस दैट इज आल्सो वन ऑफ द एजेंट और द इंस्ट्रूमेंट टू यूज दिस फॉर दिस प्रीपोजिशन इज यूज टू मेक द डिफरेंट सेंस एंड डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ सेंटेंस we have to use in different way. So students, I have discussed you that the prepositions like the place, just like the time, just like the direction and movement, etc. Also, I discussed about some different use. And here, seven points. Now I have to show one more point and the rest of the six more points also. I will discuss and you have to understand it all. So student, next point. Position. This preposition is used in the relation of the position. Just like the boy with the red cap is his son. जो लड़का red cap पहना है वो उसका बेटा है। तो वो जो red cap पहना है उसी का 
another Gigi. We choose the position. Another example, this is the house of user. Of user. So this is the shoes position of Kisi ka wo hai. Next point, purpose or reason. The reason of purpose is also to do this position just like for reason for reasons. The woman went to the counselor for advice. Yes, which reason is again. This is the reason. Another example, the organization worked for the benefit of the children. Benefit of children, the purpose. The organization worked for the benefit of children. The children are working for the benefit of children. The children are working for the benefit of children. The consistent, in spite of all his efforts, he failed. In fact, he has connected to what he failed. That the consistent or despite the phone calls, the warning warning was not heeded. Yes. So next point we shall discuss the manner. Manner that is the case. She spoke in a polite manner. In a polite manner. Puri number of how se baat. Yes. Number of how. That is the different meanings also. The preposition also used. Now source. कहाँ से आया है? जैसे लाइक डी स्मेल काउंट फ्रॉम डाउन। उनका डेज़ ही उस बात। कुछ भी आप लोगों को नहीं आता। नर्सी, डी स्मेल काउंट्स फ्रॉम डी सोर्स। फ्रॉम वेयर दिस कमिंग? और ये कैन से, आई गोट दिस बुक फ्रॉम डी सेल। किताब हम सेल से पाएंगे। यस, आई गोट दिस बुक फ्रॉम डी सेल। डेट्स the percentage was increased by 25 percentage. Yes. So we can measure and can count. And that uh, also another sector. The mystery gets more intriguing by the hour. So all these some four positions I discussed: position, purpose, concession, measure, source, measure. In all these different types of positions that we for in spite of the from by all these two positions are used to describe in various ways. So, friends, did you all understand? Now, students, let us discuss the position of the positions. We have to discuss first of point before the object. Before the object, how the preposition is used? The cat crown under the bed. Under the bed, before the object. Bed, the object is a bed. Position of what? Yeah, Hindu get the hair back to Rasmi. Okay, this also before the object used. Uh, in an interrogative sentence, the preposition is often placed before the relative pronoun. Yeah, uh, just like relative pronoun means which street means in which street. Which street does he live? Means sabse pehle in Hindu. Or which street does he live on? At the end of the interrogative sentence, the previous can also be at the beginning or at the end. Which street does he live on or in which street does he live? Either beginning or the closing of the sentence in his unit. The relative pronoun is thunder point. Uh, in statement, the preposition can be placed before the relative pronoun or at the end of the statement. The person with whom he is talking is my boss. Here you can see the statement. The preposition can be placed before the written pronoun. The written pronoun is who who said the hell with you. The person with whom he who is talking is my boss. Jis vakti jisa tu baat kar rahe the, ko mera boss hai. Person with whom he is talking is my boss. Okay. Number four. Sometimes in which or at which also. We have to use this ready pronoun. Sometimes in, in which or at which is used instead of in or at while introducing a less relative clause after the noun relating to a place. Just like uh, here, the house in which I was born was sold to a normal merchant. The house which I went had to use in, in which is made. So in which or, or at which used to this type of sentences and final point after object 
the object is placed first or for the sake of emphasis just like this i insist on object ke baad conclusion is hua or c is popular the world over c is popular the world of puri duniya mein woh prasiddh hai so after the object also the position is used it's clear now last one point on this point in informal speech uh, a preposition also follows its subject in informal speech as like this is the bottle i am looking for looking for which is of the last one this is the bottle i am looking for or this that is the woman i was referring to that is the woman i was referring to so in informal speech under the general talking not the official also preposition we can make at the end of this so did you all know this all this point now we can see the kinds of prepositions we can discuss here simple prepositions they have only one word just like after at by in at on in etc these are all simple preposition compound means by adding a prefix or suffix prefix just like a then b it a z and here above a b o b is prefix is used just like b o b f o r e then you more some here can give you above along around before behind beside inside etc these are all compound words and double prepositions are the two words from above from beneath out of yes these are all double prepositions yes from among from beneath out of out of out of stands when i am yes i can say participle means verb by by ing ing form and that is also used as preposition regarding this language regarding the this regarding the regarding this is not a preposition just Uh, considering bearing not withstanding etc word then comes phrase phrase preposition instead of in spite of in case of according to along with by way of these are all phrase prepositions there are different types of preposition using different types of uh, way just like uh, how it become preposition and it sometimes it become adverb is the bank manager in is the bank manager in this is adverb but another sentence is the bank manager in his room is the bank manager in his room so is his room that is the position only in the bank manager at the firm is the bank manager in means at her is the bank manager in his room and they say let's walk about a little at her let the child crowd about the room about the means preposition means joining of two nouns and taking a position that is your preposition okay so <coughs> you have to be complete sometimes so you have to be position so you have to go there some rules and regulations you have to follow for the prepositions i can say I uh, use your confusing, confusing preposition just like at and in. At and in. Let us discuss here. So uh, we use in when we are talking about the place of an area. We use at when we see it as a point. Yes, area. We still in Singapore. In Singapore. But our plane stopped at Bhopal. That is. At a point, एक जगह में रुक गया इन एंड एट द डिफरेंस इज दैट सो एंड एट एंड इन में डिफरेंस और लेट्स डिस्कस वाई वी मैंसन द नेम ऑफ टू प्लेसेज सच ए सिटी लोकेटेड विद इन ए कॉइंट्री यूज एट इज रेफर टू स्मॉल प्लेस जस्ट लाइक इन एड्रेस राइट एट नायपरा और एट पतोरा एट गोरत स्मॉल प्लेसेज एट इज यूज But big places in Egypt, just like in Delhi, 
in Delhi but at Padura in big cities in big places in is used but the common place in the address we write at post we know at post at then we write post not in post we don't write in but we say at post at this small village name तुम्हारा एड्रेस में एड बोला जाता है एड मीन्स ए स्मॉल प्लेस ए यू स्टेट दैट्स वाई एड इज यूज इट्स क्लियर बट अवान सेंटेंस दे सेटल एट मुंबई इन इंडिया हियर मुंबई इज अ स्मॉल वन इन इंडिया इज बिग वन दैट्स वाई ऑल्सो यू कैन यूज सी इज बॉर्न एट गोविंद गढ़ इन पंजाब पंजाब बहुत बड़ा स्टेट है उनमें से गोविंदगढ़ एक छोटा सा शहर है तो छोटा जगह को एड यूज हो रहा है और बड़ा जगह That a difference one of them. We use uh, time also as at is used for a point of time and when in is used for the period of time. We can make we meet. We shall meet at four o'clock in the morning. Four o'clock. कोई गली का नंबर अगर है वी राइट इन इन किंग स्ट्रीट इन राजपूत स्ट्रीट एसेट्रा दुली तिप्स गुलाटीस लिव इन किंग स्ट्रीट कोई गली का नाम है तो इन यूज हुआ द गुलाटीस लिव एट ट्वेंटी फाइव किंग स्ट्रीट दैट इज गिव ए नंबर ऑफ द हाउस कोई नंबर ऑफ हाउस अगर जहाँ यूज होता है एड होता है इन में से कोई स्ट्रीट के नाम में एड हो रहा है सो वी यूज इन विद नैम्स ऑफ स्ट्रीट एंड एड वन वी यूज द नंबर ऑफ द हाउस या नंबर ऑफ द हाउस एट ट्वेंटी फाइव किंग स्ट्रीट सो दैट इज डिफरेंस बिटवीन नंबर ऑफ हाउस एंड नैम ऑफ द स्ट्रीट नेक्स्ट पॉइंट यू यूज एट टू टॉक अबाउट ग्रुप ग्रुप एक्टिविटी एंड शॉप्स एंड वर्क प्लेसेस जस्ट लाइक आई एम यूगर टू मीट सुमेधा एंड हर हजबेंड एट द पार्टी टूमारो कोई पार्टी प्रोग्राम में मिल रहे हैं तो एट यूज हो रहा है आई एम यूगर टू मीट सुमेधा एंड हर हजबेंड एट द पार्टी टू नाइट यस टू टॉक अबाउट द ग्रुप एक्टिविटी और शॉप्स और वर्कशॉप एट इज यूज दे आर वेरी फ्यू पीपुल एट द मीटिंग या मीटिंग पार्टी एसेट्रा एट इज यूज नॉट इन इज यूज ओके दैट द कंफ्यूजन एट एन इन सो इट शुड बी केयरफुल Another one between an atom. Between an atom. Simply among between these two persons, there are two students sitting, and between means one more than the energy. Among means whole class. Okay. Between is used for two persons thing, and among is for the more than two. That is the difference. Simply understand the property is divided between uh, equally between two brothers. Yes, but distribute these biscuits among the poor, or distribute this sweet be among the student. Among is more than two. There's a difference between between and there's a difference between between and among. Okay, it's clear. Then in and into. In and into a difference there. Let us discuss here. In is used when speaking of thing at rest. So student are sitting in the class. Suppose. बच्चे क्लास में बैठे हैं बट टीचर इट एंटर इन टू द क्लास मीन्स इट इज इन मोशन टीचर पूरा चलते हुए क्लास के अंदर आए जो कोई गतिशील है इंटरव्यू या कोई चुपचाप उस जगह में है दैट इज इन ओके दैट इज डिफरेंस बिटवीन इन एंड इन टू इसके लिए अंडरस्टैंड मैंने मैंने एग्जाम्पल्स कर गिव सो वी आर वेटिंग इन द होटल रूम दैट इज द सिटिंग पोजिशन बट द सोल्जर्स मार्च इन टू द हॉल दैट इज Uh, in the motion position, that is different between in and into. On and off, and also like that. On is used to speaking the thing in rest, and on and off. Just in and then into, on and off. Open U P O. It also on, huh? Just like 
वी स्टूड एंड वॉच द बोट्स ऑन द रिवर मगर एक रेस्ट में है बट द मॉकी जम्प अपॉन द बैक ऑफ द कैमल अपॉन द बैक ऑफ द कैमल कैमल के ऊपर मौके रो कूदे दैट इज इन द मोशन ओके दैट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन ऑन एंड अपॉन इज द मोशन ऑन इज रेस्ट ऑन इज मोशन बिसाइड एंड बिसाइड्स अनदर एग्जांपल आई कैन प्रूव बिसाइड एंड बिसाइड्स obviously beside and besides uh, beside means the side or outside or beside means in addition to my dog came and sat beside me mere samne baitha beside matlab koi ek jagah pe baitna besides agar s agar use hota hai ki extra a land uh, just like landing his money uh, besides landing his money i found him a job yes मगर एक्स्ट्रा इन एडिशन टू बिसाइड्स मैथ्स ही इज स्टडिंग अदर सब्जेक्ट ऑल्सो सो वी कैन मेक दिस दिस एक एस का एक्स्ट्रा लगने से इसका जो सेंस है भी अलग हो जा रहा है वन इज एडवर्ब वन इज प्रीपोजिशन हियर नाउ लास्ट पॉइंट वी आर गोइंग टू बी डिस्कस अबाउट ओवर एब अंडर बिलो दिस इज द लास्ट पॉइंट वी आर गोइंग डिस्कस over above the under or you see this point over is opposite of under yes opposite of under and opposite of below is above and below let's see <coughs> so i jumped over the bench yes the child hid under the table over under opposite above and below something keep your head above the water water ke upar rakho and below here the valley is 250 feet feet below sea level above and the height we measure this and over and under measuring of this Uh, position of the space so two similar type meaning but in use is in the different way i think you have to practice this and more you can understand and hope you but i have discussed everything you have understood see you once again in the next period and have a good day and meet you once again goodbye